what is a linear array. So, we can define one linear array in this way. A linear array is a list of a finite number n of homogeneous data elements. What is the meaning of this term homogeneous? Homogeneous means data elements of the same data type. That means all the data elements will be of the type float or double or long or integer or character. So, they must be of the same data type and that is very important. And another important thing is that the finite number of. So, an array should have some space reserve which size will be finite to hold data of the same data type that is homogeneous data type. Okay, such that the elements of the array are referenced respectively by an index set consisting of n consecutive numbers. So, that means the array content will be accessed randomly and directly. That means there will be some index value which will be having some index value and using that index value and the array name I can directly access that location's content. The element of the array are stored respectively in a successive memory location. So, that is another very important aspect. That means for an array some set of finite values will be stored of the same data type that we know and those values can be accessed using some index directly not sequentially in this way. I can directly access fifth data, fourth data. So, that is also important. Another important aspect here is that against one array the memory space which will be blocked to hold data which will be reserved for whole data must be consecutive. That means, the array will have its respective memory allocation in contiguous memory locations. So, memory locations are not discrete, they will be having a continuous memory locations will be uh, will be allocated and will be assigned for this array to store data. The elements of an array A may be denoted by the subscript notation. So, A1, A2, A3, you see 1, 2, 3 and they are coming as a subscript to A. So, that is why they are known as a subscript. That is why array can also be called as a subscripted variable. So, in this way we can access or a 1 here 1 2 3 n they have written in fast brackets they have enclosed in fast brackets and we usually use this particular syntax in our basic language or in our Fortran we use this or a 1 2 a 1 a 2 a 3 n where 1 2 3 n they are enclosed within third brackets where we used to use this particular syntax this particular way to um, access array locations in Pascal in C, in C++, in Java, in Android and so on. So, there we will be using this particular uh, subscript will be enclosed within third brackets. So, th this is the way to access array contents. Length of the array will be upper bound minus lower bound plus 1. In case of C programming, we know that the first subscript of an array will be 0. For 10 number of data, for the last subscript will be 9. So, the lower bound will be 0 and upper bound will be 9 to hold 10 number of data. So, here the subscript will be ranging from 0 to 9. Then what is the array length? That is 9 minus 0 plus 1 that is a 10. So, in case of basic we can have the subscript or Fortran we can have the subscript starting from 1 and it will be ending at 10 to hold 10 such data. In that case upper bound is equal to 10, lower bound is equal to 1. So, 10 minus 1, 9 plus 1, 10, yes that is the size of the array. In this way, you can define the length of an array. So, what is a linear array? How to access data? Here, we are having the st static allocation that means the memory space will be occupied depending upon the size of the array. So, that will be the allocation will be done in a contiguous memory space. So, that is one issue. The data items can be accessed through index. So, that is another issue. And the data items will be homogeneous in nature that means all the data items should be of the same data type. I think you are getting this idea what is an array and now in the next videos we will be going for so many different operations on array. Please watch each one of them to have a full confidence and grip over this particular subject. Thanks for watching this one.